Alright, welcome back to the Pokemon Let's Go playthrough, and since I defeated those two trainers last time, I'm going to go right into the rock cave. Oh, god damn, it's so dark. Yes, I'll use light up. There we go. We finally got it all. You can now finally see what in the rock tunnel. Oh, god damn it. I'm going to have to avoid these. Uh... Wait a minute, is that a Cubone? Oh yeah, a Cubone. I don't want to get a gold bat or a Oh it's a huge one. If we get if we get this one we'll get a good we will get a good bonus. A good EXP bonus. Look at this. Alright, let's see if I can catch it. Oh, dead in the center. That's fantastic. Can I get it? Yeah! First time! Caught first time. Fantastic. Okay, so now the, um, Anna's got a lot, a lot of experience points for the whole team. Cubode's data. Lonely poke. Oh, it's the lonely one. Oh. I'm gonna be honest with you. It miss it. it I think we know which one misses its mother. Better not get. Uh, better not. No. Better sneak by gravelers in order to get through. Oh God! No! No! Please don't. We have to sneak past a lot of these Pokemon in order to get by. Oh, oh god damn it. I didn't have to do that, but... I don't think... Oh, it's a tiny Onyx! Whoa! I didn't hit dead center. I think I failed to catch it. Oh, I, but I still got it first time. I got tiny Onyx! <laughs> oh... Oh, that's giving Basil a lot of... No, I think I'll probably end up leveling Basil up in this part to put, turn him into an Ivysaur. Well, evolve him. Well, basically, if you've got to catch a tiny or a huge Pokemon, you get you get uh, more experience points bonuses. Oh, no. Not another one of these Pokemaniac psychos. Oh, no. Well, most of the time, if you go across these poker maniacs, most most of the time they have slow pokes with them. And but but if you have Pikachu, these guys are an absolute joke because slow poke is what part water, part psychic. But if you actually have a ghost type Pokemon, then this guy or dark type, then he's all these guys are also toast as well. So basically, Pokemaniacs are s real psychos. What? Why the hell they got Pokemaniacs in this game? Game over, indeed. <laughs> I like that. I like that face. The face that says a thousand words. Oh, I just got by that Graveler. Just. It's a good fit. Now, I do like how in this game you can actually try to avoid Pokemon encounter, you know, Pokemon encounters. So you can not get through. I've already caught a Cubone, so. Oh, here comes another Pokemaniac. You draw Pokemon. Isn't that considered harassment? Oh, I'm only going to show a few battles in Rock Tunnel, then I'm going to. Ah, oh, Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan. Oh dear. So it looks like we gotta do a. F so it looks. But. It's oh, you got. You have got to be kidding me. Fake out already. Already too many. We have too many fake outs. It always happens in the first turn. Whenever any Pokemon have it, it's a, one of the most annoying things is, of course, you'd be unable to. If, you, if they use fake out, you instantly flinch and can't, and you miss your turn, which really is the most annoying thing ever. It's super effective. Basil grew to 16. Oh, so now my Bulbasaur's going to evolve. So it looks like I have an Ivysaur now. That. If you catch more Pokemon, then it is all. It definite then you'll definitely be able to evolve Bulbasaur into Ivysaur. And the reason why I've got getting a Bulbasaur is because I much later on in the game there's 
the, the, for the last gym, I need a grass type and a water type. The best thing to do is I if I get if I get an Eevee, you know, if there's an Eevee, I'm going to try and raise it. I am going to evolve it into a Vaporeon, depending on what level it is. There is Eevees in Route 17, so once I get an Eevee, I'm going to evolve it into a Vaporeon and train it up for the fire for for for, for when I fought when we fight against Blaine later on the fire type gym. So you, you know, the reason why I know all the Pokemon what the weaknesses of every Pokemon type is. Well, I have played Gen One several times. All right, so up against another Onyx. So we know what to do. Let's get Lu uh, let's get Lewis out. All right, let's go, Lewis, shall we? Gloom. Your screech does not affect me. Ouch! But you are no match for me whenever I... Because rock and ground types are weak against grass types. Because basically, with ground and rock going up against a grass type, it's four times damage whenever a grass type move is used. Even absorb definitely decimates. Uh, even absorb is de absorb is devastating. Anyway, we're going to catch. Try and attempt to catch a Machop. Come on, Machop. No, I I think I didn't do it. Oh, again, I say I always say that. No, I haven't caught it because I didn't hit it dead center or even get a uh, a bone a uh, an excellent bonus. But when in fact I actually catch it, maybe it might have maybe I might have anti jinxed it. I do, I uh, I would uh, I was being a bit you know pessimistic, but I felt a bit over pessimistic to be fairly honest. I think I might have done an anti jinx there, <laughs> the opposite of jinx. Oh. No jinxing about. <laughs> um. All right. I think I'll just uh, ha hit me with your. I uh, did. You actually have to reference Pat Benatar's song. Hit me with your best shot. Uh, oh dear. Mankey. Pikachu. All right, Pikachu. Let's see what you got. No, Samson. Let's see what you've got. Like I will definitely shock this sucker to death. Sorry, Mankey, you're down for the count. Level 27. Oh, Mega Drain! Oh, yes. Finally, we get a, a better move for Acid. I'm going to leave, raise the leaf and just. Uh, it's much better than. Uh, Mega Drain's much, much more devastating than that of. Uh, Absorb until eventually down the line we get Giga Drain, I believe, which is a much more devastating but a powerful move. Right, let's let's try it on that one. Polywell. It's gonna it's going down it's going down. I'm very, very sorry, but Bubble Beam, a water move against this grass type move. That's no, that's not a good strategy. Now we've got, now you actually just shot yourself at the foot there, Black Belt. <laughs> Fired away. <laughs> Look at him, his face is so... Uh, the Pokemaniac, uh, I thought the Pokemaniacs for it was pretty funny, but oh my god, every time I see a black belt getting angry, look at his face, looks like he's about to, He looks extremely embarrassed to lose. <laughs> okay, we're up against. What about against the Geo, dude? This is gonna go down quite quickly, because. Because fight. Because rock type move against a fighting type move. 
absolute devastating. I think double kicks just. Oh, what? Oh, you sneaky! Oh, you sneak! You had to do that, didn't you? So basically, if I switch out, if I switch out, that means they'll get hurt. My team will get hurt with Stealth Rock. All right, let's see if I can get my Bulbasaur. No, my Ivy Saw to. Uh... All right, Onyx. I think my intention is I'm going to use Leech Seed on it. Because usually, I think I might as well keep Leech Seed in order to... Uh... Oh, God, no. Come on. Can I... No, I don't think I'm going to use Leech Seed. Might as well use... Might as well get Lewis out. Let's get. I'm gonna use Mega Dra Mega Drain on it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! It still uses Dig, and it still uses Dig. Ah, that's not. Okay, so I think it's part of my. I think that definitely used four times damage because of a Grass type move and going up against a Rock at a Ground type Pokemon. Four times the damage. At least I got Basil to uh, get up his levels up now. Gravel up. Okay, you know what? If Gravel is going to come out, might as well get Basil out again. Because I need to get. Because I to one. I need to eventually down the line use Leech Seed on it. Okay, here we go. Finally managed to get that done. I think Leech Seed is a very fantastic move. Oh! Oh! That was close! Too close to call! Uh, it, it, that, uh, any one more point and then that would have been it for poor Basil. But anyway, let's switch out back to... Let's get Lewis back in the frame. Even though the stones will probably hit, hurt him. A lot more. There we go. More leech seed coming up for you. Okay, let's see. Let's, let's use Mega Drain on this one. Let's finish it off. Because I needed, you know, Basil to get some, get a lot of as much experience points as possible. Okay, that's that done. Hiker Allen's given up. Okay, that's that done. Okay, I think we we'll might as well skip to when I come to what is considered to be the luckiest find ever in this rock cave. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Just then, by sheer coincidence. Okay, so let's wonder about the place. That, what is is that? What I think it is? <gasps> a Charmander! I found a Charmander in the wild. Oh, this is that's the first time I've ever seen a Charmander in the wild. Oh yes. This this must be my lucky day, folks. Okay, just for just for just in case just uh, just in case I am going to uh, use an Ultra Ball on this one because if I want to catch this one, might as well use the best catching rate. Oh god damn it! That is so annoying when that happens. Come on, let me catch you, Charmander. Oh, dead in the center. Oh, can it be the second time, Lucky? Yes! I got a Charmander! And that, that, and you know what that means. That means I don't have to catch 50 times of Pokemon now. So, so I finally got it at long last. Oh boy. 
Thank you very much, game. Okay, so I'll skip to when we're going to go outside of the rock cave, and I'll see you guys then. All right, we're back. We're back. Okay. Okay, so we're back to Route 10 now. We are out of the rock cave. Finally. That was a long slog, wasn't it? Okay, so we are nearly at our destination where we're supposed to be going. That is... La uh, that is the next town we're going off to. Pic so we're off against like, this picnicker now. So, of course... Oh, it's another Pikachu! So it looks like we got a Pikachu versus a Pikachu. So it looks like we're... So the best thing to get rid of it is Double Kick. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, I managed to... Uh, now it's going to be... And now it has a brand new move, people. Thunderbolt. No, Thunder, actually. Thunder is an extremely powerful attack, but the accuracy is... Not that great. It's not that great, unfortunately. So, yeah. Okay, so next up is PG. Oh, Pidgeotto! I might as well continue battling if that's the case. Might as well use a. Uh, let's just use Thunderbolt. Ouch. Oh dear, poor old. Poor old Samson is. Poor Samson is now in a. In a bit of a pinch. Pidgeotto is fainted, and now looks like we're going to get on with our next trainer battle after this. Poor Picnicker. Not up for it, oh dear. Alright, so who are we going to battle next? Oh, it's another hiker! Natural climbing up. Natural climbing, oh, wow, that's good. Okay, so up against Hiker Clark. So that Geo dude. <coughs> oh dear, oh dear. So it looks like poor old. So it looks like one might have to t retire him for a bit before. So we're gonna retire poor old Samson for a bit while while we get to. So you to rock slide. Oh, damn it. We're on our last knees. So it looks like I'm having to use a super potion on uh, Basil. And give him more help. Oh, another rock slide. Okay, so we got... Um, that was, I believe that was a... Oh, you could give me a side attack. I think we got a vine, had a vine whip, I believe. Uh, I wasn't paying attention because I was like... Chatting to a friend of mine. Oh. Okay, so up against Graveler! Come, okay, so I think we might use Leech Seed against it. Or maybe we could get Lewis out and use Giga Drain on it. Oh dear. Please don't make it faint. Oh, thank God. Thank God for that. So, so that's a good... Uh, shall I Sable? No, I don't think that you know, heals the penny, you know health back. It's only for status and conditions. Rock slide. <sighs> Jesus Christ, when are they going to stop with the goddamn rock slide for once? Okay, let's finish it off. That's no place. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, 29. Lewis is up to 29. And Basil has got up to level 21, so that's good. Oh, Bomber's up to level 21. No, I don't want to uh, learn agility. Ha Hiker Clark, oh. Well, you'll be like the picnicker who basically is tired because of that long... Uh, that long uh, trip to... Uh, 
that long trip to uh, through the uh, rock cave. Uh oh. I'd like, yes, and I would like to defeat you. I will defeat you. Charmeleon. Charmeleon. Uh, looks like. Looks like I'm gonna use thunder on it. Yug, that's what thunder does. It's a really, really powerful move. Sometimes it doesn't hit, but when it does hit, it's really devastating. <laughs> you just being a Pokemaniac, that's not good. That's not a good thing to be a Pokemaniac. The answer is delicious. Oh, are you being are you being bison again? Is that come a bit do, doing a bison quote? Crabby. Oh, it's a water type. That's easy. I'm gonna thunderbolt it to death. You might as well use thunderbolt just for just just to be on the safe side. All right, so that's one out, and another one out is Sand Slash. Might as well get Basil out. Basil time. It's time we this Ivy Saw time. And Sand Slash is out. Better get a whip. Might as well hit it with the Vine Whip. I think I might have to use Leech Seed on it. I'm no, no, I'm still using Vi Whip. Give it, get a few hits to the face. Okay, you know what? Let's get Lewis out and just finish it off there. Because I think I, this, uh, this is basically a, a bit of a tactic in order to share a bit more experience or more sh bigger share of the experience points. Sun slash its ground, so. Whoa! Ouch! Might as well make a drain it to finish it off. And that's it! That's that that's the sand slash down and out. Camper Trent is gone. And now we can finally get on with the next. Then we can get on to our next town and. It's one of the most spookiest music ever. Wait, what is that? Cubone? A Cubone? What is it doing there? <gasps> Paul Bunnell? What is Paul doing there? Oh my god, it's the Pokemon Tower, isn't it? Most, it has the most. This has got to have the most eerie music ever. Lavender Town has. Anyway, let's go and rest up our Pokemon because we're going to uh, cut out this part. Let's we're gonna cut the part out. Yep, it should be. They should be all better now for Pokemon. All right, so I think I'm gonna save here because I know I'll. Because at the time I like if it completed my uh, my my record my recording session on that. So with that being said, I'll see you guys next time for when I'm going to go through on my way to the next city, which is Celadon City. So I will see you guys for the part for part 13 of the Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu playthrough. So I'll see you guys in the next part.